It was good. I say 15, 20 feet above the trailer, right in the center, is where it's all starting to flame out. Joseph Collier says he and his wife were sitting on the couch when the whole room shook. We heard a big old boom. So I come out and looked, and over on that side, it was like real dusty. So I'm figuring something over there blew up. He says the explosion was unlike anything he'd ever heard. I mean, right over here, not even two blocks from us, is a rock quarry. So we hear blasting all the time. I mean, this was literally like, you lighting off a stick of dynamite and throwing it down in a concrete well. I mean, it was just a complete explosion. The home was destroyed by the flames. Charred wood and melted plastic were left behind as the man who lived here started cleaning. Firefighters say they got called to the mobile home on Cottonwood Lane just before 9.30 Tuesday morning. It took roughly about uh, two hours to get under control due to the spread of the fire and the intensity of it. Crews say at this point they're not sure what started the fire, but say the two people who were inside made it out safely. Collier, who shares a yard with the home destroyed by the fire, says as soon as he saw the flames, he knew he had to help. I basically drug him all the way out to the street to get him away from the trailer while it was going up in blazes and everything like that. The fire department says their investigation is ongoing. In Charlestown, Emily Maha, WLKY News.